Vitamins are simple organic compounds which are usually not synthesized in our body and are taken with the diet. There are different types of vitamins like A, D, E, K, B1, B2, B6, B9, B12, biotin, folate, and niacin, and some other types as well. In this short tutorial, we shall discuss only types and their chemical names and the categories of vitamins. Vitamins are basically divided into two categories, one which are soluble in water and the others which are soluble in the fat. So keep in mind, while taking these vitamins, you must take them with the water or with the fats like milk, cheese or butter etc. The fat soluble vitamins are vitamin A, D, K and E. Chemical names of vitamin A is retinol or beta carotene and the chemical name of vitamin B, D is uh, cholecalciferol. Vitamin K, the chemical name is philoquinones and minoquinones while vitamin E is called tocopherols. Water soluble vitamins are further divided into two types, non-B complex vitamins and B complex vitamins. So non-B complex uh, is the only one ascorbic acid which is vitamin C and is considered as the most important vitamin. While B complex vitamins are further categorized into three types uh, energy releasing, hematopoietic and some other types as well. So among the energy releasing vitamins are thiamine vitamin B1, riboflavin vitamin B2, niacin vitamin B3, biotin vitamin B7 and pantothenic acid vitamin B5. So these are the vitamins which are involved in the energy releasing processes or metabolism in the body. Among the hematopoietic uh, which are involved usually in the regeneration process uh, or uh, you can say it's uh, involved with the stem cells are folic acid vitamin B9 and cobalamin vitamin B12. There are some other types of vitamins as well uh, like pyridoxine vitamin B6, pyridoxal and pyridoxamine. These are uh, lesser important uh, while well, still they are important and uh, not much is known about them. So that's it for today. In the next tutorial, inshallah, we shall discuss uh, the vitamin A in detail, their sources, their functions and uh, how to take them, when to take them and their deficiencies as well. Stay connected. Thanks.